not a shock that Buster, Buster seems to have definitively lived through that exercise. Um, he's definitely a little worse for wear. <laughs> but uh, all of the metering equipment we had on him says that he survived that fall. What it tells me is that if you're going to fall off a building, this is not a half bad way to do it. You know, I mean, I wouldn't recommend trying it, but if you got it, I'd go this route. <laughs> But Buster's not the last dummy you'll see dropped onto some awnings. Dangerous mark, middle eye. Soon Adam will take the plunge and show how they stage a big drop in Hollywood. <laughs> While Adam prepares to plummet, yeah, so Tori, Carrie, and Brad are cutting to the core of Bye another night. Hollywood favorite. Can a sword really cut through up. another sword? As happens yeah. in the Count of Monte Cristo. Move the pillow so Cody can go in, but then put it back. Grant's building a mechanical rig that will wield a blade with the same speed and power as a trained swordsman. Your cutting sword is going to go here, horizontally. And we wind up the cable on this drum and hang the weight off of here on the other side. Very bright pony there. When we release the weight, Pulls down. Any ideas for Christmas? Pulling the cable off the drum and swinging the sword around. Just like that. Nathan, there's just one tiny design flaw. The arm swings at neck height. Decapitation hazard, everybody. Which means a lot of walking around like Gracho Marks. 48 miles per hour is the target.